What I wanted to show today in the Make Code Minute is using a Circuit Playground Express to act as the tempo clock for a couple of these little pocket operators, little pocket synthesizers. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn it on, and you're gonna see it start flashing to a beat, and the music should start playing. Uh, there we go. If I adjust the tempo on my Circuit Playground Express by pressing the down or A button, both of these stay in sync. And here you can hear, here's just the drums. Here's just the bass. Here's both. And now let's bring the tempo up. Inside of Make Code, in order to set this clock, what I'm doing is on start, I set my BPM, beats per minute, to 120 to start with. That's the number we're gonna be changing. This is called parts per quarter note. Essentially, this, uh, these things sync on eighth notes. So I've set two parts per quarter notes. And we're gonna use a little function here that says convert BPM to clock pulse milliseconds, because milliseconds is what we wanna work with inside of Make Code. This function you can see here just does this little uh, variable, clock pulse, using some math, which is this formula of 60,000 uh, divided by beats per minute times part per quarter note. So that gives us the milliseconds of one clock tick. Then when I press either the A or B button, I can increase or decrease by five. What's happening in the forever loop is it's gonna send clock pulse. And that function is right here. What does that do? It sets digital pin A1 high. It pauses for milliseconds. So the clock pulse itself is very, very short. And then we set it back down to low. And then we pause for that clock pulse duration, which might be 20 milliseconds or something like that, uh, to give us our beat. In my forever loop, I'm calling that function. I'm setting the LED and the NeoPixels to high or on, in purple in this case. And then when I set the, uh, the next one, next iteration, I drop those low. And that essentially gives me a light that's happening on the quarter notes. And you can see that here if I turn this back on. Uh, you'll see that's flashing essentially at the quarter note even though the clock pulse is being sent out on the eighth notes. And so that is how you can create a little sync clock for all your little synthesizers or big ones for that matter using the Circuit Playground Express inside of Make Code. And that is your Make Code Minute.